I founded a small business and is president of the Conservative Republican Alliance of New York. And here's Christopher. What's going on, uh, my fellow patriots out there? We did it. We did it. We got Trump in office, baby. Woo, man. It's been a long four years, a long four years, 48 months, man. But we finally got President Trump in office. Make America great again. It's but it's going to be. This is just a first step. This is just the beginning. This is just the beginning. We got to come together as Americans, and I'm not just talking about Republicans. We got to get the Democrats to get them on board because what they got to understand now that Trump just not just won the electoral vote. He won the popular vote as well. Yeah. Let's keep it real here, folks. Let's be honest here. Let's, let's be honest. So MAGA is not some MAGA cultist, uh, MAGA cultist. Uh. No, no, no. We are the majority, folks. We are the majority. And we won't be silent anymore. That's right. Yeah. So we're not the silent majority. We are the majority. So let's, yeah, we always were the majority. I heard it over there. Yeah, yeah, we always were the majority. Let's keep it real here. Let's keep it honest. It's 2020. We are the majority. So with that said, Let's come together. Let's stop acting like we're some weird occultists that need to be cast off to the side. The view acting like we're some weirdos or whatever. Tim Walsh using like some weird weirdos. None of that. No, we need to work together and we need to work together to get things done for the country. We need to get things done for America. The world is waiting for America to come together and make America great again. And with Donald Trump in office as commander in chief, that's what we're going to do. That is what we need as a, a leader, a real commander in chief. My dad, an Ar army major veteran, taught me at a young age. The commander in chief is the highest ranked officer in the military, a true leader. And Donald Trump showed me when his first term what a true leader looks like. Right. That is the best commander in chief I've ever seen in my lifetime as a 40 year old man in this country. And I can't wait to have him back in office again and lead this country again. And with him back in office again, what I've learned is he can't do it by himself. He's going to need we the people to have his back to get things done. And I've been preparing for him to come back. These last four years, what I've been doing with my grassroots group, the CRA, the Conservative Republican Alliance, is t teaching people what you got to do is get be get ready because this is the year where you got to be become a committee man, a district leader, get involved in politics yourself because you can do that. Our forefathers prepared the government to fight a corrupt, uh, 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 corrupt governments. Uh, you know these freaking. If you're dealing with a dictatorship, how to use the government against that? We the people to fight against it and take over that and do the right thing with it. So this is how you do it. Become a committee man, become a district leader, be fight alongside Trump and as we the people and get things done, get things done with him. So this is how we do it. This is the year we do it. Run and become committee men, run, become district leaders. Let's get in there alongside Trump and let's bring change along this man with his great policies he's about to bring for this country and let's make America great again. And like yeah. always, God bless the United States and God bless everybody out there in American citizens. And let's get these legal aliens out of here. Yeah.